Hello and welcome to Hindi Sen News. You are watching English Bulletin with me, Ratnakar. The news in detail. The number of corona positive patient is increasing in the district. Everyone needs to be careful in order to break corona chain as well as to prevent the infection from increasing with the treatment of patients infected with corona. Nagpur District Guardian Minister Dr. Nitin Rao directed to implement strict and effective implementation of the rules regarding corona. The Guardian Minister also directed to close schools, colleges and coaching classes in the district till March 7 along with the Meet Zavabdar campaign announced by Chief Minister Udav Thakre to prevent corona infection. In a meeting held in the Divisional Commissioner's Office, Dr. Nitin Rao reviewed the situation. At this time, the Divisional Commissioner Dr. Sanjeev Kumar, Commissioner of Police Amitesh Kumar, Municipal Commissioner Radhakrishnan B, Collector Ravindra Thakre, Chief Executive Officer Yogesh Kumbhajkar and others were prominently present. Eight new members were nominated to Standing Committee of the Nagpur Municipal Corporation during special meeting held in this concern on Monday. BJP has nominated Prakash Boyer as the next chairperson of the Standing Committee and his name would be rectified during next week's meeting. He represents Prabhat 36D in the NMC's house. On behalf of BJP, Sandeep Jadav, ruling party leader, submitted names of Prakash Boyer, Sanjeev Balpande, Sushma Chaudhari, Prakriti Patil, Bharti Bunde to replace the equal number of corporators whose one-year tenure was completed. Congress leader of opposition Tana Jivanwe forwarded names of Neha Rakesh Nikose and Manoj Kawande for filling up party's quota of two members, while BSP group leader Vaishali Narnavre nominated Narendra Valde. Later, Jadho interacting with a newspaper, a newsperson said that BJP has decided to nominate further seven carpenters on the Nakhul Municipal Corporation Standing Committee. A criminal was brutally murdered by six assailants on Jaitala Road under the jurisdiction of Sonega Police Station on Monday evening. The accused first bashed the coon and when he escaped from their clutches, they chased and stabbed him to death with sharp edge weapons. The criminal was released from the jail on bail just three days ago. The deceased was identified as Anilesh Rajesh Naidu, a resident of Kamla area. The police have arrested Mayur Sherikar, Govind Dongre and Sagar Bagga for killing Naidu. Three others accused, Suchit Chahande, Ashish Bandekar and Vishal Gondane are still absconding. A police official said that Sherikar owned a mobile phone shop, MS Collection, in Indraprastha Nagar. He was also main accused in an attempt to murder case. Naidu on Monday came to the shop and accused Sherikar for following bail of Nikhil Kharat and Golu Malwe. As the problem of parking is increasing day by day in the city, ordinary citizens have to suffer. Therefore, it is necessary to make proper arrangement for auto stands and parking in the city. In this regard, Mayor Dayashin Kativari instructed officials to inspect the new area in the next one month and submit a proposal for an auto stand. A meeting was held at Civic Headquarters on Monday with concerned officials regarding the availability of space for Ola Uber vehicles in the and also regarding the location of auto stand in the city. The meeting was attended by Deputy Mayor Manisha Dhawde, ruling party leader Sandeep Jadho, leader of opposition Tana Jivanwe, Pratod Divya Dhurde, senior councillor Sunil Agrawal, additional commissioner of NMC Jalash Sharma, regional transport officer Vinod Jadhav and others. General manager of Smart City Dr. Pranita Umredkar was also present on this occasion. Vapcox Limited, the company laying a water distribution network in unauthorized layout, slums, etc. under Amrut in city has requested for 24 hours shutdown to carry out Godhani Gorevada 400 mm feeder maintenance connection work on February 24 from 10 am to February 25th at 10 am. Meanwhile, Nagpur Municipal Corporation and Orange City Water have also planned to carry out some major work during this 24 hour shutdown, like Hanuman Nagar ESR inlet and outlet wall replacement and page 1 WTP electrical yard replacement of isolator and DO set on the incoming four pole electrical structure inside the substation. For carrying out these works, page 1 water treatment plant at Gorivada will remain non operational from February 24 from 10 a.m. to February 25 at 10 a.m. and water supply in part of Gandhi Bag, Mangalwari, Dhanapet, Dhantori and Satanjipura zones that were catered will remain affected. Well, that's all from this bulletin. For more updates in and around the city, stay tuned with NBC News. Till then, Ratnaka says goodbye. Please take very good care of yourself. Keep watching NBC News. Sachadikai, Vinachupai.